Jews, Christians, Muslims, Native Americans standing in unity Sunday in Albuquerque, honoring those killed Saturday at a Pittsburgh synagogue. More than 100 people gathered on the sidewalk outside the Holocaust and Intolerance Museum of New Mexico. Some offered hugs and words of encouragement, others joining in prayer for the shooting victims. Dayan Hockman Vigil says the shooting brought back painful memories of a time she says she was the victim of anti-Semitism. She says she saw a woman leaning over her car, spitting on her bumper sticker. Are you a Jew? You look like a Jew. Vigil says it left her utterly devastated and ultimately inspired her to run for state office. So I could either succumb to that experience and the fear, the abject helplessness and fear that I felt, because I had never been threatened before in my own country, in my own hometown, or I could fight against it. Through all the prayers and tears, there was also a call to action, the call to continue fighting against hate. And we have to fight that. We have to, we have to stand up. These people here came to say, we're not going to be defeated. Activist Sami Assad says people must stand together as Americans, celebrate diversity, and fight against those who try to divide this country. My hope is to have more dialogue, more open conversations about where to take the country in the future. Reporting, Brandon Evans, KOET Action 7 News.